Ice jam season has arrived in the Quad City area. That season typically starts in early February for our hometowns. The National Weather Service says they haven't seen any major ice jams in our area yet. Any that do form could cause some localized flooding. Lower, lower river levels this year allowed more ice to form on area rivers. Along the Mississippi River, ice jams are less common because it's so wide, but smaller rivers like the Rock and Wapsie are more vulnerable. Our river levels are so low that uh, any ice jams that we make are just going to, at the very worst, it's going to be very localized, minimal impacts uh, just upstream of where they uh, where they form. So we're really, as far as like big widespread impacts from any of our ice jams in the area, it's just I'm not seeing it. Nothing like they're seeing over on like the 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 Kankakee uh, and uh, the in, in uh, south of chicago that's uh that's it's we're a whole different world from there right now and looking ahead to spring the national weather service will release three flooding outlook reports the first will come out february 15th those look at current conditions plus longer range forecasts to determine flooding risk